Hey there everybody, welcome to the final lesson in this course, Getting Started with Axial. So in this lesson we're going to be exploring basic interactivity, and we're going to be using our wireframe that we built in our previous lesson. So what do I mean by basic interactivity? Okay, so basic interactivity to me is linking pages together. And that actually might sound scarier than it actually is, but Axial makes linking pages and components together super, super easy. So remember in the first lesson when we spoke briefly about our inspector page panel and the properties where we can see all of the different interactions listed against the component. So to actually start kicking that off and to start linking and adding interactivity to widgets and components, we can simply highlight the widget that we want to perform that action on. So for example here we're going to link home to our home page. So we'll begin by highlighting the component on the page by using one click and then over here on our inspector panel we have an option to create a link open that and we can simply highlight the home there and it is as simple as that now here once we've actually done that we can see what's happened there so again on our inspector panel we have a case here that says on click case one open home in current window so that's just telling us that the home page is linked to the home page and again, we can do exactly the same here. So let's link about us to about us. Services to services. And contact us to contact us. So here, once you actually add interactivity to a widget or a component on Axior, you'll see the kind of highlighter, like the one, two, three, four little blue box highlighter. And that's just really to display that this component or widget has some interactivity applied to it. So it's just, it's just telling you that and calling that out for you. So we can begin by testing that right now by hitting preview. And what preview will do is just open up our wireframe in the browser. And then here now when we click on about us, we can see the URL changing here to about us. We haven't actually got anything on that page yet, but we know that it works. And again, services, the URL is changing to services and contact us to contact us. So, okay, that's cool. So the basic interactivity is actually working, but let's go through and actually add a little bit more detail onto our wireframe now. So under About Us, we could probably copy a lot of these components here and then place them on our About Us page, Services page, and Contact Us page. Now, just for the sake of this wireframe, let's just quickly identify these pages for the sake of our prototype by adding in the title of the page beneath the logo. So about us here, we'll just quickly put about us, copy that onto services, like so, and to contact us. Save that. Yeah, untitled, test one. And then we can go back and preview that. So again, this prototype might make a little bit more sense now. So we can click back to home. We've got our home page about us, services, and contact us. So cool. So that is some really basic interactivity in Axior. Like you can see, it's super simple to do that. And that will help build some basic prototypes.